Good morning, friends. So I wanted to start off by just saying emotions are addictive. Emotions are programmed and how we react to them is also pure programming and pure addiction. Now, if you don't know what I'm talking about, so just look at any time you have an overwhelming feeling or an anxious thought or you get angry, it is nothing but programming. It's nothing but, it's just habitual. Most of us are habituated to have these experiences. And this morning, that's exactly what happened. I was finding myself getting so annoyed and angry and frustrated and overwhelmed with pretty much, I can give you the, the scenario, but that's almost irrelevant. And what I realized was I hadn't made time for myself. And when I don't make time for myself, that's often when these feelings come up. It's almost like I'm programmed to react when I don't make time for myself. And it's in a way, it, I have gratitude towards these, these feelings or emotions that come up because it's telling me, stop, take a minute, take a deep breath, and go and make time for yourself. So I wanted to come on here very quickly to just share that experience about you know, when you're finding yourself kind of in this, in this, in this um, habituated uh, reactions or emotions or feelings, that's your cue to stop, take a deep breath and say, okay, what do I need right now? And so when I tune into what I needed, I really needed time for myself. I needed time to meditate. I needed time to sit and journal. I needed to get clarity in my head around what was happening and what I needed to do for my for my business, for my life, and that's what I did. I packed up the kids with Assad and I just sat down, I meditated, and I sat and journaled. I really got clarity around why it was bothering me so much because one of my biggest goals is to help detoxify the mind. The mind, if, if we, you know, we often associate talk, detoxing with the body, but the mind is also filled with toxic thoughts. And it's as bad as toxins in your environment or in your body because when you have toxic thoughts, it affects your, it affects your entire day. So this is what happened, right? This morning, I was filled with these toxic thoughts and emotions, and I was spewing it all over. I was yelling at the kids. I was yelling at Assad. And then I was like, what the heck am I doing? Why am I doing this? And it, it, is, it is like, it literally causes havoc. It's literally toxic, toxic to your environment and toxic to your system. So it is so important to curb these things. So my, my invitation to you is not to judge when you have these reactions or have these emotions. Take a minute, stop and ask what you need. That is your cue to say, this is not working, let's, let's, let's stop this right now. Because what, you can stop it, you can absolutely stop it. It is just programming and it's just habitual. I hope this is helpful for you and if it was, please put in the comments, share with me how this, is, um, this has impacted you and what are, you, what are your tools, what are your specific tools that you will use in order to, to, to stop this process of addiction to these thoughts. All right, have a great weekend, guys.